mathematics, which is very difficult. I'm struggling with this one. Can you help me? Let me see the problem. Sum of odd numbers between 1 to 100. Can you teach me how to do this sum? You know, come to my home. Okay, I will come. Finally, now I'm going to teach you how to do sum of n odd numbers. Finally, for example, you want to do summation of odd numbers. One to check. What you will do? Let one, three, five, seven, and nine. And nine plus one, ten. And three plus seven, ten. Extra fun will keep here. And what do you do? 10 plus 10? 10 plus 10? 20. 20 plus 1? 25. Like this you will do. Suppose you want to do summation of odd numbers. 1 to 100. What do you do? You write 1 or odd numbers. 1. I like this you write all odd numbers. And of all cuts to that is long process I can be. Yes. Now I am going to teach you one technique. Technique is used is a summation of odd numbers. The technique is n into n. This is the technique. Okay. 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 Now I am going to example. You are taking one to ten. Some summation of all numbers 1 to 10. Then n is equal to 5. Why means all numbers are only 5 and 1 to 10. Then n is equal to 5. This is any plus 1 or plus 2. Means n also 1 or n is also 5. We have to keep these both numbers into the formula. Why means n is equal to 5, n is equal to 5, n is equal to 5. Here we can say 1 more into. We keep into. 5 fives are 25. 25. It is too easy, right, Tommy? Yes, it's very easy. Now I am going to take to a problem that is summation of all numbers. Or two or three, or then in this n n is equal to fifty. Then one more n is equal to five zero fifty. After this, we have to keep n n is equal to fifty n is equal to fifty. Then we have to keep fifty. Then here also fifty. Finally, you know. Yeah.